Well, my goodness, look who it is. It's Brad. How have you been, Brad? Not too bad, Juanita. Well, I have your cabin already. You wanted the big one, right? Well, Juanita, that's why I wanted to talk to you. See, we won't be staying here in Moore's Modern Cabins this weekend. Oh, Brad, no. Say it isn't so. I'm sorry, Juanita. It's my brother-in-law. He is a douche. He is still mad about the rat bite he got here last time we stayed. How is he doing? Well, he did lose those three fingers and had to get a painful series of rabies shots. But he is a douche. Brad, if you do not stay here at Moore's Modern Cabins every winter, we won't be able to stay in business. What are we to do? I'm sorry, Juanita. We have bought a cabin just down the road and we won't be staying here ever again. Oh, Brad, no. This can't be. I will give you a very good rate, $50 a night, you stay here. No, we bought our own cabin and won't be staying here anymore. You stay three nights and I let you stay one night free. Juanita, it's not the price. If it were up to me I would always stay here at Moore's Modern Cabins. I've often dreamed of watching my kids get married here. Of watching my grandchildren here. Seeing the next generation of mice mature to the size of large house cats, but my brother-in-law is a douche and wants to stay at a cabin that doesn't have crackling electrical wires hanging from the ceiling. We stuff those wires up in a ceiling and you stay. No, we bought a cabin Juanita. We add working smoke detectors and you stay. Please Juanita, don't make this any harder than it needs to be. We take asbestos out of the walls and you stay. Stop please, you are breaking my heart. We add flushing toilets and you stay. Damn it. To hell with the others. I will stay here Juanita. Moray's modern cabins is a part of me and always will be. I will stay in the big cabin tonight. Is it unlocked? Yes it is. Just watch out for the family of rabid raccoons living in the stove. <laughs> <laughs>